I have a feeling wandering around there in the middle of the night is a pretty bad idea. So let's get a little sleep and maybe a little food. Ooh, and some wine. <laughs> I believe that that is the quarry he was talking about. He did mention we could see it from here. I think he was talking about the starting point, which is probably there. We've got to follow a stream until we find a path and then just head up the path and we should find some ruins. And then we're looking for a hat. I think so. Right, let's just go to the Tanner area and leave pebbles there. And then make our way on foot. It's pretty early in the morning. We've got a lot of daylight. Oh, I'm just going to peek in to the tailor just in case if he's uh, if he's managed to get back i can repair my darker gambeson that way i've actually still got a spare although you would have thought his trip was going to take considerably longer wouldn't you i mean uh, it might have been a quick trip i just don't think it was going to be. Welcome, Henry. Hi. You don't actually do repairs, do well, you? Well, how did it go with that husband of mine? Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. I tried all sorts of things. I did everything in my power, but nothing helped. Oh, Henry. You were my last hope. All I can do now is pray to the Virgin Mary for a miracle. <sighs> No repairs. Well, the, the, I mean, the thing is, is there is a backup plan that I didn't mention to Johanka. I'm just thinking perhaps that's um, not going to work now, if it ever was going to work. All right, so we've got no tailor, no repairing, and the tailor's wife is probably not. Well, she didn't seem angry at me, just disappointed, I suppose. Okay, so that is the quarry. He said between the quarry and the marshlands, right? Where would the marshlands... Oh, God. Oh, all right. Never mind. We got across. Yeah. This is where the... There's the quarry, and there's the marshland. Now, where's the stream? I found a path. But I'm guessing that is not it. I mean, I wasn't expecting to find a path. Okay, yeah, no, we, we just follow the path around, I guess. And then as soon as we see the stream, turn up. We might have been able to get pebbles a little further. Okay. So, yeah, no, probably. Probably a little too rough. Right. I'm looking. Here's a stream. I've got to follow its course upstream, deeper into the woods. And not fall. Right. Yet yeah, it is a bit steep. And a little treacherous. It'd be best to not actually climb in the stream, but... It... All right. That's a path. Okay, the path is... Oh. Maybe that's not the path he was talking about. What do you think? 
He mentioned a path. But the path just sort of turned around and came here. All right, let's just keep following the river a little. If we don't find another path, we know that was it and that it must have turned another way. I reckon I can't be even halfway. That forest trail must be higher. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say that felt a bit too early. So we just keep going until we find out whatever surprise is awaiting us. Because I'm still not convinced that um, our uh, merchant is on the level. Could this be? What do you think? Could this be a path, a forest trail? I don't think so. I don't think so. I have a feeling I'll know it when I see it. Like some... Oh, bunny. It's been a while since we've done any hunting. Is... Ah, looks like this is where Pavel went tumbling. Oh. Okay, Pavel of Collins Chaperon. And... What about his hat? I can't remember where he said he dropped his hat. I assumed it was... Oh, I wonder if his hat was at the bottom. Or is that... Does that count as a hat? Actually, I think that is a hat. Isn't it? Yes, it is. It's a hat. The chaperon. Chapeau. Of course. Right. I, was, I don't know why I was expecting something very similar to the hat he was wearing. Yeah, I suppose people can decide to go for a change rather than replace what they lost. That makes sense. Not actually in love with either of the hats, so... Well, so far, then, his story seems to have checked out. Okay. How are we doing, by the way? You're... Uh, are you peckish? I'm going to give you a little more food, although I'm a tiny bit got for you. worried... You'll love this. ...that I have given you way too much food recently. I think this is about the fourth time I fed you in about 12 hours. I'm, ju Ooh. I'm just really wa wanting to make Good sure boy. that uh, you don't go running That's off. My boy. Because I don't really fancy explaining that one to Teresa. I mean, I obviously don't want to lose you either, but I'm not going to lie. I'm way more worried about annoying her. It's nothing personal. It's just, you know, we've got a thing going on. And, I mean, I know this is this is going to sound callous, because, look, I'm sure, I'm sure you're a great dog, you know, and I love dogs and everything, but you're also a present from a lady, yeah? And I hate to say this, but if you lose a pr present that your lady friend has um, given you, you're in a lot of trouble. I mean, a lot of trouble. I'm, I'm not making this sound any better, am I? No, I'm not. Okay. Okay, a hunting spot. An empty... Yeah, yeah. I'm... You've discovered an interesting sight. This just looks like someone's hunting camp. I... Oh, oh! Uh, why do you... Okay. Poaching, are we? Okay, 
No, I'm on guard against Krumos here, see? What? Oh, on the lookout for Cumos, are you? Aye, the whole countryside's full of them. Oh, Cumans! You must have smelt them yourself. Cumans! <laughs> oh, I can't say I've smelt any Cumos here lately. You haven't got a nose for them. Cumos have a funny smell about them, see? Like a mouldy foot rubbed with blueberries. We are talking about Cumans, right? No? <sighs> Is there some abandoned settlement somewhere nearby? Aye. At the end of the trail through the woods. Just follow it and you'll get to this mysterious kind of place. I saw some mercenaries going there not long ago. Probably hunting Kumos. That ain't my style there. Kumos. I'm more of a sneaky fella. I like to spot them at a distance or crouch behind a wall. Okay. What's so mysterious about this place? There's a lot of lairs and dens. Valuables left by ancestors. You only have to put your ear to the ground and listen to the stones, know what I mean? I don't, but I can imagine it. Even the branches whisper sometimes. Uh, I must admit, I was... I, I can't... You just... You look a little... Almost like you've fallen and someone's stolen your boots. Okay. Is that suspicious? I mean, come here. Is that suspicious? You'd think somebody who was doing something suspicious would try to seem a little less insane. Although, a good way to throw off suspicion is to just seem like a crazy guy in the woods. All right, let's go and see if there are any humos. I must remember this spot when I'm on the way back. Must I? Why must I? Okay. Why must I remember this spot? Can you see anything here of interest? Beyond a great big bloody rock? Uh. Okay. Keep going. I'm not. That's not the ruin I'm looking for, is it? That's a rock. I mean, that's just a bloody great big rock. What, you think you can stand in my path, Boulder? I won't give in that easy. Uh, okay. Uh. Okay, it's a boulder. Sort of. It kind of, it does look a bit like masonry that's destroyed though actually from that side and it's just from this side it looks like a great big bloody rock but there's a torch in the rock okay I am just more than a little weirded out I'm supposed to start between the Sasau Quarry and the marshland at the point where the woodland stream flows into the river. If I follow the stream uphill, I should find a woodland path that joins it. Pavel lost his hat there. Found it. If I follow the path closely, it will lead me to an abandoned settlement deep in the woods. The hiding place is in one of the ruins there. I mean, an abandoned settlement. This is not an abandoned settlement. It's a weird rock that I seem strangely determined won't get in my way. But, you know, I wouldn't have described that as an abandoned settlement. Unless I was, I don't know, a thousand years old or something. Which would, of course, make this even weirder. Right? Right? 
Okay. Talking of even weirder, right? He's been shot with an arrow. What's happened? Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, oh, what happened? What was I going to say? I was going to say something, and then and you got in the way, and I. What was I going to? I, I was having a thought. I was having a thought. And you got in the way. What was I thinking? I was thinking I might be changing my mind about bloody well losing you. Okay. Was I thinking anything? Did I did I have a thought? A respected Colin Berger. Right, yeah, no. Nothing! No. I, I, I... Lost my thought. I've lost my thought. Damn it. Okay. I'm going to have to be very careful not to have a train of thought. A move. Just move. I don't want to accidentally... Please, move. No. This doesn't look good. Brilliant thought. Oh. Okay. Dog, please move. I'm trying to pick up the quality arrow. It's evidence. I'm... Just, just stop it. Okay. Maybe I should. Oh, I didn't bring pebbles. I don't have my sneaky stuff. I tell you what. Uh. I, yeah, no, piercing arrows is good, and let's <laughs> just be ready for anything, right? Okay, I think I see the abandoned settlement. I'm here at last. Shh. I'll have to comb the whole place. Yeah. I honestly don't think I'm going to have to. I think something horrible is going to happen. Something open? Something else that is horrible. <gasps> Custodian's orders. <laughs> The bold knight, Sir Sebastian. I suppose I should tell him about it. Right. Let's read those orders. Is that? That is a ladder. That is a ladder. Come with me, Mott. I want to find a spot And I want to just read the letter whilst out of sight. See if we can figure out what on earth is going on. Okay. I, the bold knight Sir Sebastian von Berg, do hereby charge the man-at-arms Prokesk and his company to patrol Sassau Woods and to keep watch and maintain law and order and protect oddest folk against Cumans and other brigands, and to seek out and challenge any such foes and deal with them as befits. In these aforementioned matters, there may be, they may present themselves and act in my name, assigned in Sassau and witnessed by Abbot Peter of Sassau Monastery and 
Bailiff Hashek. That, that just means these are his men. And I suppose he does have a reason to send people out here, doesn't he? I mean... Right? We're not... We're not suspicious of him, are we? I'm hearing voices. I'm hearing voices. Dead and looted. There's a camp. So there's a camp. And there seems to be... I don't like the idea of crawling down into a pit with potentially hostile. Oh, it's Cubans! Oh, it's Cubans! Oh, are, you, are you thinking of hitting my dog? No way! Okay, okay. You! Oh. Okay. Alright, there's a guy, there's a guy with a bow. I should really be changing! Oh god, okay, I should... Keep you... And... Come on, that's a combo! Okay, nope. Oh! Oh, god, really?! You managed to put your weapon away and do a master strike! Really? In one go? Ow, I've got an arrow sticking out of me. Good. Just, I mean, nice move and everything. Probably should have my sword out. Probably instead. Dead. Okay. Why is there a human helmet parked there? All right. So they were just out here camping, basically. Do you think they've got anything to do with this situation? Do they, do they just take residents up here and unfortunately happened to be here when I turned up to find what I'm finding? Or is there something a lot more sinister going on? Is that a... Okay. Right, better piercing arrow, garlic, and a gold cross and some drinking water. That... This must be someone else's hiding place. I'm s okay. Is this a common hiding place for bandits? All right. Well, I'm not seeing a lot. Okay, have you found something? He sometimes woofs at odd moments, but then other times I feel like he's actually woofing to tell me something useful. Salami. Okay, I can give that to the dog. Actually, I should probably check how you... How are you? You are... You're doing actually okay. You didn't take much damage there. That's good. I should also check my armor because... Oof. What? Have you sensed something? Is someone sneaking up behind me to hit me in the back of the head? Or are you just saying, don't forget to pick up the sausage? See, none of this stuff is really that valuable. 
I mean, I can get a little bit of money. Mm, you know what? I'll take. You know, they're not that heavy. Oh, a little bit of money here and there is going to help. Was there a weapon? Yeah. I'm just. I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out. In what way I'm going to get betrayed by that man. And of course, it is completely possible that I'm just totally paranoid and he's exactly what he said he is. Oh, you know what? I, I think I've got. I think I've got tons of arrows. But I've checked everywhere else, and I can't see anything. Do you think these were the mercenaries they hired to ambush him? But then why would these guys have shot those guys? This is... Nothing about this is making much sense. Look what I've got for you. Unless You'll this is just this. literally the hotspot for people of ill repute. Here, have some button. Good job. I can actually teach you to hunt, apparently. I can actually teach you to hunt. Good boy. Yes, you are. Very good boy. That's my boy. Yes, you are. All right. So, I'm going to guess you will be hanging around. Oh, look at that, 100. You will be hanging around up here while I go down there. Yeah, I'm a little worried about the blood. Okay. These are not my arrows. They look different to the arrows I plucked out of the other corpses. All right, here goes. You stand guard here, yes? Actually, that is kind of useful. Okay, mushroom. All right, now I probably have some night hawk, but honestly, it's kind of useless in here. Okay, stop picking. No, leave the mushroom. It's kind of useless in here because there's no light. All the Nighthawk does is make it a little cobwebs. Hmm. Oh, is that a hint? That could be a hint. That could absolutely be a hint. All right. Oh, I've got a head wound. That's probably a hint as well. Let us take... A, um, Marigold decoction. Should I take a Nighthawk? But you know what? The only thing is, is when I go back up, it's going to be, uh, very, very bright. All right. You know what? Just in case. Okay, no, it's... Ah, oh, there's still a little bit of light. Oh, actually, it's not that bad. Oh. Oh. Really? Just so very typical. Where does this lead out? Where does this lead out? I could probably have just come straight here without killing the humans. I mean, there was no way I was ever going to be leaving humans roaming around. No, there wasn't. But... All right. And black. Feather. Okay, that does not. This must be someone else's hiding place. Yeah. Okay, so that's not it. Is there something else? That's a fireplace. Uh, no. 
Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. He didn't actually specify any... He hid it in one of the buildings. Was there multiple buildings? Oh, really? Am I... Am I... Am I now... Oh, please tell me I'm not... Trapped in here for the rest of... Oh, God. Oh! I want to get up there. I, I sort of feel like I might... Oh, no. Come... God, I want to... No! Okay, it's slipping. Is there... Is there some... Okay, I don't think there's anything up there. All right, stop making a total fool of yourself. All right. Stop taking... More of a fool of yourself. Oh, come on, let me... Oh. On the bright side, by the time I get out of here, I may have given the Nighthawk potion time to wear off. Along with the rest of my patients! Yeah, I'm definitely not seeing anything up there anyway. All right, okay. So... And it's not here. I mean, this is not it. So where the hell is it? All right, oh God, it's gonna be so bloody bright. Were there any other buildings? Okay, we've got another very busted up building here. Let's try not to get stuck on it again. Ah! Pavel's dagger and a reasonable amount of money, actually. Here it is. Groshen and a dagger. Yeah. Decide what to do with the donation. Okay. Well, oh. Just, right, well, I was going to donate it to the monastery, wasn't I? Okay, was that it? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just getting this really odd feeling that I'm missing something really important. I know at some level there are plenty of people running around willing to kill plenty of other people. But when those people are not me, I can't help but wonder why. I know the answer is like probably they saw us and we didn't want them telling anyone or they looked at us funny or they had something we wanted. But there's just something about this entire scenario that says sinister. There's also something that says, my God, it's bloody well bright, but I think I can figure out that minor mystery. And what is it with the rock? What is it about this rock that I'm missing? It seemed important to me earlier. Draw in a blank. Okay. Oh. Uprooted oh, tree. Um. Still on the lookout? Always. No Kumo will get past me. Ah, uh, yes. I hope you don't mind that I killed a few of your Kumos near here. I don't mind. They multiply like rats, they do. So do mercenaries. And they'll carry on fighting each other till the end of days. Ah, 
I'm just having one of those days. Okay, so I want to go and have a word with the merchant. Give him his dagger. I'm wondering if I should speak to Sebastian Von Doodle what's it and just check that he hasn't got a little insight. I mean, he was sending men out there. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do that. If he's on the lookout for some merchant that fits the description of the man in question, yeah. I might need to know that. Oh, God. Yes, I might. I'm just yeah. going to assume that the um, gentleman is going to hang around until I return with his dagger. I have a feeling the dagger is the important thing. Oh, God. I mean, if it was the money, he would have... Unless he wants to try and kill me once I return with the money. But, I mean, I could have already donated it by the time I go back to him, so... Yeah. All right. Uh, oh. Hello. Yes, I did promise you something, didn't I? Right. Okay. Uh. Excuse me, sir. I need... It can wait. Uh. I haven't seen Johanka for some time, but you, on the other hand, seem to be constantly running around her. Tell me, how is she? Is anything the matter with her? If anything at all is troubling her, be sure to tell her I'll be glad to help. Um, she's, she's doing fine. She's doing fine. She, no, she does not want me to talk to you about this. Why do I have to call him sir at this point? Can I not, like... Pull a bit of rank here. I don't know how that works. Probably not. Look, she's, she's fine. She's doing well. I'm glad to hear it. Did she happen to mention me? No, not really. She wanted to... No, no, uh... no, not a word. Well, give her my regards and tell her if she should need anything. I shall be happy to oblige in any way I can. All right. I'll tell her. And next time, she doesn't have to send you. She can come herself, can she not? I'm not here about that. Although I have a feeling maybe I should be. Um. I found this document in the woods by Sasau. Careful. It's a bit bloody. Don't tell me those fools got themselves... And to hell with it. And did you come across any cumans? Yes. They're finished. There now. It's not such a fuck up after all. Here's some money for you. It was supposed to be for those idiots, but it seems they asked for a hundred groschen more than they deserved. See you later. So, okay, so you were just sending them out there to hunt cumans? Nothing to do with the... Nothing to... Okay. Uh, okay. Decide what to do with the... Give the money to the Sassau Parish Priest. Give the money to the Sassau Bailiff. Make a donation for the common good. Give the money to Sassau Monastery. Pavel wants me to donate his coin to one of the causes. I decide who should get it. I should go and talk to the potential beneficiaries and see who I think is the most deserving... Uh Okay. I should do right. Before I do that Before I do that, should I should I Okay, should I go and give this guy his dagger back? Yeah. I mean so far, I'm seeing nothing 
that makes him look anything other than he presents himself. Yeah. I mean, everything he said so far has turned out. Did my dog... Are you two related by any chance? Mm -hmm. 